Hey Gary, my name is Miguel Ogas. For some context, I work in full-time ministry. I run a network of churches for my lead pastor where I'm traveling about twice a month and you have inspired me to give my wife my laptop computer so I do all of my business full-time through the phone. I believe everything you're saying about the future of the cell phone, so I just wanna figure out how to do it right. So my question to you is this, what are some tips, tricks, apps, any type of hustle advice you can give to somebody who wants to run a network, run a business completely 100% through the phone, no longer using a laptop. Thank you for all you do. Appreciate you. Have you seen the Google phone? The, p the Pixel? The Pixel? I haven't seen it. It's amazing. Do you have it? I have two of them. Yeah. And so what, You you are have you made the jump to phone 100%. Only? 100%. You have no laptop? Uh, no. Well, I you have rarely one. rarely use my, I have, a, I have a laptop, which I'm like, if I have to download a bunch of, like right now I'm downloading a bunch of Google photos. Has such a great suite of products. They've it's amazing. Made, they've made, do I assume docs and mail and calendar. It's amazing. Or, yeah. So It's like intuitive and smart and, uh, and it's like, you know, you'll have an appointment and it's like, would you like to add this to your contact book? It's like improving itself the whole time. Such a miss by Microsoft. I thought two years I ago. I had that phone, I love that phone. I thought Microsoft, when, it was, when it's dead in the cell phone world, I thought they should have come out with a Microsoft phone that was built to be yep. you know, the business engine yep. that it sounds Google has executed. From my standpoint, there's only one smart hack. I can talk all about everything, different apps. Here's the reason it works for me. Anything that isn't great on the phone, mm -hmm. you scale through another human being. If you're able to afford an admin, which, or, or use some AI assistance and things of that nature, yep. I don't write, as my team will tell you, I don't write any, like my emails are one word mm -hmm. or like an emoji. Like I do so little actual work that if you're working in Excel sheets yeah. and Word and PowerPoints and these things, it may be a little trickier as somebody who doesn't, as somebody who has like the team send, here's the proposal, can you approve it? And as soon as I get it, I write approved and they're like, you didn't open it. We can see right. that you didn't open it. I said approved, <laughs> motherfucker. You know, and so I think you have to know yourself but I think the human element of having an admin or somebody else to close the shortcoming but I think the, I think living in a mobile Sometimes only Sometimes I try to add real. a few words because I'm the same way. I'm like, thank you, approved, good, yeah. great. And they're like, I just wrote a treatise. And I'm like, well, maybe you could slim it down Oh, it's a like, bit. it's the biggest thing. It's the biggest inside joke <laughs> here. Like, People write seven a... paragraphs yeah. and I write back the thumbs yeah. up emoji. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they're like, fuck. Like, can I get a little more feedback <laughs> Something. here? Something. Something. I worked on this. <laughs>